Here it is. This is what I carry out. This is like my 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 power my power all my power stuff's in here. I try to keep it organized. This is where my flashlight is, batteries, power pack, camera stuff. Well, let's just take a look. This is from Max Edition. This is a newer version, it's newer where it's uh, laser cutted stuff. I don't add nothing else to it. You got, I did. There's little strips that you put on here. You could put in your backpack, but I can't. I just stick it in. So it has grommets. It's not waterproof, so there's grommets, so it drains water. But nice grab handle. And let's get right into the first part. Now I put some stuff back in here because it normally stays in here. So my headlamp, it just sits in there. So I just grab my headlamp. It's always sitting on top. Bam. It's there. Right now, the as you see. Usually when I store this in there, the battery, when I leave, or when I leave here, I take this off and I store the battery backwards. So I don't accidentally, and I've seen this as tips, this is tips, I'll store that backwards so I don't accidentally uh, turn it on inside the pouch. I don't do it to the flashlight, I don't know why, I just never had an issue with the flashlight going off, but this, this does for some reason. It's very sensitive, it's like it doesn't take much, Let's see. So that stores in there. These are batteries. These are just uh, match cases, but uh, these are dollar twenty-five match cases, and they have a seal on it because they store my twenty-six hundred milliamp uh, batteries. These are equal to four triple uh, A's, I believe. Four, yeah, four triple A's. That's what these these batteries are bigger. So these aren't your standard uh, batteries. That's why they last longer. There's a circuit breaker. There's a circuit in these, I guess. Three point six volts. Yeah. 26. I thought these are number one. These are the newer ones, I guess. Like these will last forever. And I have two. I have two of these in here. Two of these with that. Plus, I have my. And this one is my older uh, PD32. And oh, well, it is on. I guess I, there's a. The button switch is pretty hard to push on that, so it's not going to accidentally come on. So that sits in there, and I don't I don't overcrowd my bag. Down here, I have this, which is supposed to be a backup. It's the goal zero flip, 20. Flip it, charge it. It was for my phone because I have the Samsung S8. It charged it once and it didn't charge again. I don't I'm not sure what was going on with that. It doesn't work. I mean, it works. It just doesn't work for what I wanted it for. I still kept it. And there's a cord in the back to charge it up, which I could charge that up with my goal zero, uh, goal zero, what is it? Goal zero. Uh, solar charger, which I didn't bring. You, I'd only bring that on a larger trip. So there's only two compartments to this. That one there, that one's empty now. You open up this, I got magic fiber wipe, and that's for keeping your lenses clean, whatever. I bought a bunch of those. So that's all it's in there. Then we get right into this. My goal zero. Goal zero. Blue light means that she's fully charged. This is just the Venture 30. This is does me enough. You know, you got your cord around the side here. Very nice and neat for charging stuff up. So yeah. You got your it's kind of a smart charger thing. This works. This is small enough, it works, works for me. And then in the back. What do you want to get in? Let's get into this here. And I also carry my Pelican, Pelican case, which ke keeps all my uh, memory cards. So I'm, I'm, I'm good for like a month. Like I would never fill all these. <laughs> it's very rare that, even when I'm shooting my videos on three days, it's very rare that I change out the, the, the SD card in that camera. Plus I have another backup camera that I'm using. So yeah, so I got like, you got like 32, 32, and I got two 64s because they were on sale last time, so I, um, you know, it's overkill here. And I got to take a few. There's adapters in here for smaller uh, micro cards, and I got an 8 gig. So that 8 gig still has to come out of there because who uses an 8 gig now? Especially when you're shooting video, that'll fill up. So I'm, I, I like it good for two months. And this is kind of like a water. It does have a seal on this. This Pelican case. It's a little rubber seal around here. So, so it's a little rubber seal around there. But I love this little case. Not only that, if you pull these up, this one here's a little different, so if I can pull, get one of these there, they'll fit the other cards behind it. As you can see, there's a space behind it. So if you had the smaller ones, 
what are they, the, the mini, I don't know what they're called. So they go there, but also on the other side, I believe. Yep, on the other side, you can get the micros. The micros will fit in, in, in that one, in behind. I do have a micro here. I have a 32. There's a 32 micro. It fits in behind that. If you want to put that in behind there. Awesome case, so stick that back in there. So don't know why you'd want to stick it in there. I guess we didn't have the adapter for it. So yeah, so that's a nice little case. That stays in there. That's part of my camera stuff. Now I also have this is empty now. I don't keep much in there. This here is from Think Tank. This is not, I'm using this for something totally different than what it's meant for. It's meant for, I believe, same thing as the, the memory cards. It's supposed to hold the memory cards, but the bigger ones. So this here just goes around my neck if I want. If I was out shooting a lot, I'll put that on with the cap so it just sits there. So if I was out, bam, open this up. Kind of just opens up like this. Check that out. Just, Take that back off. So inside here, this is where, because of my camera, takes smaller batteries. This is where I store my batteries. And it holds one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight batteries. I got eight batteries in there and they're just separate and they're organized. And in behind that, I got another uh, microfiber cloth. A little spot in behind holds that. So you see here. So what I'm going to do is just pop one of these out right there. So this is what my camera takes so I'm gonna pop that in so my camera takes these they're about the size of a memory card a little thicker though but they actually fit in this these are this is actually for memory cards but this works perfect for my camera now if I ever change my camera up this would be useless to me then but yeah so what I do also do when these are in here I, I store them up the shiny side with the batteries shiny side up that way I know when I'm looking inside here that that's a live battery because you, and there's one in there already I got downward it's pointing down because that's a dead battery so I just it's just the way I do it that's a dead I'll start from the bottom and every time I right now I got two more dead ones they're in another smaller case in this they're like I mean it's the size of the battery it's a small tiny case that I carry and that stays on me so as I'm hiking or something this here stays in the pack usually I know when I'm hiking out two batteries can get me out of here if I'm hiking like three or four hours so I can do a flip on my camera I always try to keep my battery in my camera you never know what's gonna pop out at you what's gonna happen you want to get that shot right so yeah so I've got one two three four that's eight batteries that stay in there so nice I really like I really like that case but like I said I'm using it for something different so other than that that's it so that's and this is like an accordion accordion so and everything fits in there nice and neat so it's just so I'll stick that back in there. I just fold that up. Nothing's too tight, nothing's overcrowded in it. Got my goal zero, it goes in there, just everything just fits nice and neat in there. Just you know, bam. Got your Pelican case, it goes in there. Put your microfiber cloth back in there. That doesn't have to stay in that's a brand new one like this, why it's stuck in there. Yeah, and we're just gonna stick the goal zero stuff back down in the bottom. Little loop down there. You know, got that in there, well, as you can see. My flashlight, it was hooking off one of these. Stick that cord back in the back. Two batteries. In my Phoenix flashlight just sticks on top, so it's, it's a quick grab because that's the one you're going to grab the most. Use your headlamp, if any. Boom, it's all done up. I like these nice uh, poles on it too, the newer poles. Very nice. Yep, so that's it. That's all my power source. And I carry my tripod with my camera on this, and I carry another backup with a small case, and my other camera just stays inside. It'd be nice to put the camera in there, but no, not for him. I can't say that there's not enough room to know. My camera's small enough it could fit, but no. I took out that other charger. I likely could get it, but you never know. 
it's one of those things where you uh, play around with it and you see what but I like it because it's organized but it's not overcrowded I don't like stuff overcrowded it's a quick grab it's that way you're not losing stuff you're not fumbling you're not taking out the whole thing then you're picking out what you want and shoving the other crap back in but yeah so that's my like little power source the only other thing that wouldn't fit in there would be my goal zero uh, you know the solar panel charger but I would only ever take that I think now I don't even take that out because this is enough to get me through I wouldn't take that out when I was out for a two week or like a week or two weeks. I can even get a week with all this. It's just because I have so many batteries to my camera. I don't, and I don't use a cell phone. That's the only thing I really I've been charging with that. So yeah, other than that, that's it. That's pretty well. That's all my electronics except for my watch. I've got my watch on. Other than that, I don't. And my cell phone, and that's separate. But yeah. So. Hope that helps you out if you're organizing anything. I don't know where I came up with. I just seen I just seen that pack and I was watching reviews on it and I said, "Will that work?" I didn't know if it would work until you don't know if these things are going to work. So it's a little scary on when you're buying it. It's like you hope when you buy it and you go by the measurements and you're like, "Well, certain things fit in there and you hope they do when you get it." And sometimes they won't work because then you got to use it for something else. But I have another one of these, not, not the same. It's a little smaller version. And we'll do a review on that. That's my, I changed out my uh, first aid kit, which was a little smaller. I made it a little uh, bigger. Well, later. Just a little quick uh, update there on the, where I keep my batteries in, the think tank, those little uh, pouches. This is a little small one. It's in, a, in the back here, you can put a little memory card if you want to carry that there, right, so it's right on you. You know, a little, little loop. Nice. So I got this. Same thing. This is not meant for what I'm using it for again. And it's a, you know, it's, it is a battery wallet, but it's for the bigger, uh, I think this is from the SORs. So it fits one battery in there. I think you can get another one that fits two. But because of my batteries are so small, I can carry two in here. So I can carry two of these. You know, my lithium for my Aleppus. Actually, I could carry three in there, actually, but I carry two. I could like to put a third one. Yeah, a third one will fit no problem in there because they fit right in there. And I keep the shiny side up, the sunny, the sunny. I keep the shiny side up, the, the positive, where the, the contacts are. I keep them up so I know they're they're good. So when I go to when I go to put the next one in, I'll flip it down. So I know it's dead. Same with my pack. Like I, I flip them around so I know they're dead. So when I go to open that, not that it's a bad thing. You grab it, put it in, it's just gonna show dead again. That's just gonna waste your time. So so right now these are good. So I've switched those out. Usually these stay on me. So when I'm hiking with my backpack on, they stay in my side pocket or in my pants pocket. I can put these anywhere. Just nice to go out because when you're shooting video, it dies quick. I never had an issue running down because I think I got a 64. Pretty sure I got a 64 in that camera now or a 32 or 64. It takes a lot to, uh, even all the video I shoot out here and pictures I take, I maybe change my, uh, once I remember changing the, the SD card out. So yeah. So yep, sweet little thing, later.